What's up guys, it's Ray from AchievementHunter.com, just walked into the office and I'm in a commentary mood, Halo Spartan Salt, three achievements, you saw them all right there, forgot them all already, the first one is on Operation B, Mission 3, this achievement requires you to go through the whole level without a jackal uh, getting its shield back once you destroy it, so these are actually the only two jackals I kill in the whole level, so if you're new to Halo, jackals are the shielded enemies, they're really fucking annoying actually, and you hit them a few times, you shoot them and their uh, shield will disappear, and then after a few seconds, the shield will come back. Now, something I do here as well, which uh, I learned the hard way, the Marines that follow you, I, I think the Marines, maybe they're always Spartans. I'm going to go with the Marines. The Marines will shoot the Jackals. They'll, they'll shoot enemies on their own, but if they shoot the Jackals, they'll destroy the shield. But Jackals will usually run away when the shield is gone. And at that point, the Marines will kind of stop shooting. Thus, the Jackal will get its shield back, voiding the achievement. So what I did there is uh, one Marine got stuck in a corner, which was pretty fortunate. The other one... I had to uh, try and fight a turret, mano e mano, and it pretty much died, so rest in peace that marine. Now with one marine dead and one marine stuck in a corner, I just run th through the level normally. All you have to do is kill six elite commanders, and if you see here, I'm just trying to avoid every single jackal as possible. There's a lot of suicide grunts as well, so obviously you want to get away from them, but also when you kill them, you want to make sure they're A, away from jackals, or 2, they're close enough to jackals that if they drop their grenades they kill the jackals. I went with the uh, make sure they're far away from the jackals, so this is 300% speed. You can see me do this a lot, the Halo uh, Spartan Assault missions, just because like you have to play through the whole mission and 9 out of 10 times, uh, a lot of the stuff I really don't need to show. I just need to show like a s doing something specific and then getting to the end of the level, so that's why it's fast sorted. But if you do it correctly, you will get the 20 gamer score achievement, nowhere to hide. Uh, finish the mission without any jackal regenerate, regenerating a shield in Operation B, Mission 3. 20 gamer score. Off to a good start. Next is on Operation C, Mission 3, Assault on the Supply Lines. And for this achievement, you need to, uh, do a lot of spinnies on the turret. But actually, you need to kill a wraith which with every single, uh, turret on this level. So, this level is pretty much a straight line. There's two turrets on the right and two on the left. Now, I, uh, I misunderstood this achievement at first. I thought you had to kill every single wraith with a turret which isn't necessarily true so I got a uh, two on the uh, two on the right and two on the left or excuse me two on the right one on the left and here's the last one on the left I'm, I uh, shoot the wraith off screen you saw the award there for sentry that's how you know you did it and I fucked up the first time because I stood on the first turret and I just kept killing wraiths and I didn't get the achievement and then I had to reread the achievement and realize I'm a dumbass so very simple achievement two turrets on the right two turrets on the left you can let a wraith pass by because uh, the mission is going to, uh, or the achievement is going to pop as soon as you do it. So feel free to let a wraith pass by if you are too slow. Also, you have stealth. So if you're having trouble getting to a turret, you can do that. Now, for this achievement, I believe it's called Brute Force. This is, uh, I believe, Operation D, Mission 1. Very short mission. Uh, to get this achievement, all you can do is melee, throw a grenade, and use brute shots. So, uh, thankfully, uh, brutes spawn infinitely in that first area. So you can kill them to... Uh, get brute shot ammo you can melee grunts it's actually pretty easy of a mission as you can see the mission's already done it takes roughly 10 seconds to beat but uh i showed you this just in case you didn't know where there were uh the grenade locations like the grenade boxes but if you do that very simple achievement but you can miss it i missed it the first time through brute force for 20 gamer score so there you go the third achievement of the fucking video finish the objective using only the brute shot melee and grenades in operation d mission one you're welcome